gave her arm. Yeah, but wait, that, this is this is we're speaking over forty years or so ago. All right, this. Uh, yeah, I what are you doing? doing? What were you, Ray? What we were in the fifth grade, maybe the sixth grade, like the fourth grade. No, no. Listen, I knew you when you went to the the kitty school. I met you through Max. This was later. All right. Anyway. Where are we are supposed we? to do construction Let's do shit? Some home improvement. Uh, mm -hmm. Hey, what's up, guys? We got a video question for you. This one comes to us from Justin uh, from Monroe, Louisiana. Thank you, Justin. I've forgotten every compliment anyone has ever paid me, but I've never forgotten Ray asking me what's wrong with my mom's arm. <laughs> yeah, Ray, right. mm -hmm. get it on. Shh. Love the podcast. Got a little quick question here about a canopy. Mm -hmm. uh, they got blown over by Hurricane Isaac. I actually had it attached to my barbecue grill with a ratchet strap. Mm -hmm. and still didn't stop it, so I'm thinking about it. Uh, putting it uh -huh. holes here into the patio with some concrete screws or mm -hmm. something of that nature. I just want to know if yeah, you can break me in what kind of screws or uh, silicone or mm -hmm. concrete glue or something you can right. uh, use yeah. for that. He's got himself. He's got himself. You can go to AdamCole.com if you want to look at this. Um, he's got a nice little patio thing with four legs, metal legs. They make a corner. It's going to be easy. He's got a slab. He wants to hold it down. He has a break in the top of the thing, like a little cupola in the top of the square thing, so the, the, the wind can has a place to kick out uh, so it won't be toppled like it was. <laughs> He, uh, he, he, or it could be a vent for the barbecue, he, maybe. He, uh, I like the idea that he took his barbecue and that he tried to you know, put some tie downs on it. All right, uh, I'm yeah, gonna, not a bad idea. I'm gonna say this, right? Get three more barbecues. I'm gonna say Capcom, pretty easy, right? Yeah, absolutely. Um, Capcoms are great because back in the day you had to drill a hole and then you had to put something in the hole and then you had to put your screw into it. Now you drill the hole the right size. And you put your Tapcon bit into it. Now that's the blue screw, and I like the nut drive versus the screw drive, and it's also going to sit better because what you want is a uh, pan head type or, or a, so nut, a nut. Down. Yeah, you don't want a you don't want a flat head or taper type screw or taper is what you don't want. So that's good. Now if you want to be a little anal about it, you can drill your hole and then blow out your hole of the concrete. And I always like for me. When I'm putting almost anything in of a threaded nature, not into wood, but especially in anything masonry, I put a little dollop of silicone on there. Silicone or even glue. Ain't gonna hurt. I yeah. like the silicone because it keeps its flexibility and it's it's gonna work nicely. Blow it out, fine. Uh, here's my one piece of advice, though. Get yourself a torpedo level. That's the very small, like, eight-inch level that's sort of tapered a little bit. And it's got a magnetic strip on it. And put that magnetic strip 